The VFW, a place where many veterans go to socialize and reminisce on times and memories made while serving our country. But Carleton's VFW has sat empty for several months due to the pandemic and could be forced to close for good. CBS 3's Emma Quinn shares how students have taken it upon themselves to help those who have helped us. A community staple since 1934, the Carleton VFW is in danger of closing due to the pandemic. Right now we're into the fourth month of being shut down, which basically shuts down all of our fundraisings for uh, the community, the uh, veterans hospitals that we help. The nonprofit didn't receive any CARES Act funding the first round. VFW members say they're down at least 50% in revenue. And we use all that money to help in the community and to maintain the building. So members of Carleton High School's Student Council and Social Studies teacher Ryan Schmidt created a GoFundMe page to raise money. We have a pretty close relationship between the school and the um, and the armed forces and so it was just kind of natural for them to see the need and to understand that it was something that they could help with. The kids said the veterans have already done so much. It was time to return the favor. These are people that, you know, they've already given service to the country and they still are serving our community with some of the things that they do. And now they're in kind of a tight spot and it's just a chance for us to, you know, as corny as it sounds, to give back. VFW members say it's humbling knowing they're getting support. Yeah, it humbles us. It humbles us. It makes us feel appreciated. It really does. So far, the students have raised more than $1,500, and their goal is to raise $10,000. For more information on the fundraiser or how to donate, you can find a link on our website, cbs3duluth.com.